All right, here's how to add historic mining data to Google Earth. <laughs> I'm gonna try to recreate how I found it. So I go to the mineral resource data system, click on this link, Let's see if I can find it. We're going to download data for uh, geographic areas you choose. Pick your state. I've only tried California. And then we want um, Google Earth format. But this file will be pretty big and it will slow your Google Earth down if you don't have a decent computer. So you hit the download button and my internet's moving pretty slow so it took me like 25 minutes to download it so I'm not gonna re-download it again, I'll just show you where the file goes. Um, and then you go to download file data and you click on this and then when you do that, you know the little save button, hit, hit the okay, I'm not gonna do it and then it'll go up here in your download you can see I already downloaded it right here. So when it pops up, it should automatically launch your Google Earth and the file should land in temporary places. But remember to save save this. So create yourself a, a new file, add a new folder, and we'll just title it the same, Mineral Resource Data System, like that. And we'll move that folder up there. And we'll put this inside of it. So then now we have it saved because you do not want to turn this on all the time. It could fry, or not fry your computer, but really slow it down. So all right, here it goes. So this will show all mining data, historic in California that this system has. So let's see. And it will make your Google Earth move a little bit slower. So I don't like to ever do it like this. I'll zoom in on an area, then click the button. It seems to be a lot more effective. You can see how many mines are all over California. So let's just um, um, let's just go anywhere. We'll just zoom right in somewhere here. Um, where the heck are we? There's Cedar Creek. Okay, here's a good spot up here. Let's just go by anywhere. So let's just pick like these hills right here. All right, then you click the overlay and it'll show you every little mine that was, well, it doesn't give you a ton of information, but it tells you what they were looking at. Most of them are gold mines, you'll see. Gold mine kind of gives you some reference and I find it to be a pretty good tool locating old mines and you hike to them. Sometimes you don't even find them at all because they've caved in. But you can just kind of go along rivers and see where the mines are at. Reading the comments from Sam. No, we have not already done a video on this one. It's actually pretty tricky to figure out. It seemed easy me doing it, but it took me forever to find out how to do this. But it, I, I find it useful. It's, it's really cool. You'll be surprised where there was mining done. It might be in your backyard.